All right, y'all, I have a project to share with you. Made a custom bug net. Just fitted to the back of the car. And uh, all I had to do was buy a four by four piece of basically window screening. You can barely even see it, but it's here. And I went to Ace Hardware for that. Um, it is 99 cents per square foot, so it was four whole dollars to get all of the netting that I needed. And then what I used for the fastening was Velcro. Um, this stuff is heavy duty, industrial strength. It holds up to 10 pounds. I actually used this for my curtains inside too. Um, but it comes in these little strips that just look like this. So it comes with two of each side and then I just cut it into the pieces that I need. So each of those pieces are dispersed throughout the top. So here, 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 just points of contact to make sure it's spread evenly. Over here, down in the corner, at the bottom, another corner, and then up here. And uh, the sticky works really, really well on the metal and the plastic. That's what I learned with the curtains, trying to attach those. Um, it's not gonna stay to fabric or a screen quite as well, so I sewed it onto the curtains and the bed mattress cover. But then for this, I don't really have a sewing machine, nor do I want to sew this screen. So I used a hot glue gun, and I put hot glue on the outside of each one. And now what I'm gonna do actually, just for extra points of contact and for a nice finished edge, I'm gonna fold over the outside and just glue it to those same Velcro backs all around, just so there's a little bit of a lip. It'll be easier to tell how to apply it then, like which side is what. Um, and it'll just be a little cleaner. So that's the last step. But now my car is bug free, the way to be. And I spent eight whole dollars on it. Um, very worthwhile project. Definitely have read from a lot of people that you want to have a bug net. So successful project done for the day. Well, almost. And uh, not too much left to go. I'll show you some cool stuff tomorrow.